Guy Major is another standalone equation tool that can be used for creating forensic images and performing disk cloning. And it developed by the Guy Wonkgen and Guy Major is completely open source, has many of the same features of DCD and is also only available for Linux based hosts. So while some investigators may prefer command line interface tool, Guy Major is a graphical user interface tool and is for beginners so it may be preferable. So for the executions I will be using the very same 1GB flash drive using that we used in DC3D examples and at the end of which we can compare the results. So as previously done in the DC3D execution, we should first ensure that we are familiar with the devices attached to our machine. So using the sudo fdiskl command, you can list the devices that are attached to your machine. And as you can see in this case, we have one gigabyte, uh, one gigabyte hard drive here, mm, or a secondary drive here. So now we're gonna run the guy major here. So guy major can be started by using a menu in this Kali Linux menu here, just guy major and you need to root privileges to run it. And here you can click this, enter your Kali password. And as you can see here, the guy major started and you can also uh, run it from the command line here. As you can see, here, this is the same result we got here. And the guy major application runs. And as you can see, it then displays the existing drives recognized in Kali Linux as in the uh, following screen here, the details of one gigabyte uh, flash drive used are is shown here. So as you can see, here, the Linux device shows the DevSDA or SDB model uh, hidden areas the, the information like this here so uh, in, let's get started by acquiring uh, dividends with the guy major here so to begin the acquisition, acquisition process uh, right click on the evidence drive uh, in this case it's the dev stb and select the accurate image so note that the clone device option is also available should you wish to clone the evidence drive to another again as previously mentioned when cloning a device uh, the capacity of the destination device must be equal to or exceed that of the source original evidence drive. So before the actual acquisition process starts, the investigator is prompted to enter details about themselves and the evidence under the following um, sections. The first is file extensions file format, destination, uh, and uh, sp destination split here, see here, and then the case management uh, information, in this case, the case number, evidence number, and um, examiner time, description, and informations like that. So in destination here, destination tab, we have the image directory, image file name, and info file name. So image directory means the location of created image file and log file. This means info file. Uh, the image file name here, um, image the, the, as the name suggests, uh, the name of the image file. And info file name, the name of the log file containing acquisition uh, details. And also under this tab here, we have the hashing and uh, hashing calculation and verification tab. This, um, this tab here uh, has multiple uh, hashing algorithms and can be selected and calculated, allowing the investigator to choose MD5, CHA1 on CHA256 here. So this, re uh, this checkbox here, uh, reread source after acquisition for verification means this, this verifies the uh, storage after the image process. And as the name suggests here, this takes twice as long here and verify image after acquisitions. And this also ta takes twi twice as long. So this verifies that the image has been successfully created and does not contain any errors that may have occurred during in acquisition. So for new users, you may find the specified directory where the image file will be saved. And uh, in the destination section, uh, so click on the image directory here uh, and choose your location here. In this case, I'm going to choose the home directory and create a new folder named guy major test and enter it and choose here and image file name here as you can see here. So now let's fill this case number here. Uh, case number uh, guy major guy major test 001 001 evidence number 001 the examiner oxali a description one gigabyte flash drive acquisition acquisition and using 
Sky Major add notes uh, like just take the some notes here notes blah blah here and the split size is as two gigabytes and we're gonna we're not gonna split these files because pretty small uh, one gigabyte so we not we don't need to split the file here so we I, I'm I also want to calculate the CHA one and verify take this verify image after acquisition and uh here okay so we're gonna set the image file name uh first or position one and click on the start here special director of special which are not all of them yeah so we i'm sorry we have to change we don't we don't have to click on start and so as you can see the state changed to running and as these are the press of uh press, process of our file so and click on that here and as you can see there's a blue tick here the color of the state button change and uh, indicating that the acquisition process is finished and as you can verify the and okay so here uh, if the verification finish and verified as you can see here and the progress bar all displays the 100 percent so our output file and um, info file can be found the director which we already choose and here you remember the major test here this is our file we accused here so this is a two megabyte here yeah as you can see this is here so our output file and file can be found on this uh, directory or whichever you choose in this example and if you have selected a different directory change the di to change to the name directory using the cd command here so i'm going to close it we don't need guy major anymore for now and ls cd guy major test ls and as you can see files ls la here so we can also browse the desktop as we did earlier uh, to open info file which parents uh, presents us with information about the acquisition details here open it and as you can see we got the information here we have uh, hashed the md5 cha1 and here sha 256 and the acquisition speed here and the clarification speed here it just two uh, we just took two seconds to verify it and four seconds to accuse it because i have pretty speed i have a like a perfect computer high-end computer and as you can see the system call here host name here so in next lecture we're gonna do the windows memory accusions here